Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Two weeks ago, Tara Campbell Hatcher was arrested following a minor accident in Pikeville when she was completely innocent, something we all think could never happen. It's an overwhelming, helpless feeling. It's like you're screaming and nobody's listening to you. When officers ran Tara's license, it showed she had a felony warrant, which was actually for a different Tara Campbell. But because of a clerical error several years ago, the innocent Tara Campbell was arrested and her mugshot was posted online. The whole world can see it at a fingertip. You can just, I could find it right now in two seconds. It's, it's that easy to find. It's that easy to look at. And it's, especially when you're innocent, it's, you don't ever think you're going to see yourself in a mugshot. Since her story first aired, Tara has realized this is much more common than she ever thought. And I've received so many messages, hey, this happened to my mom. Hey, this happened to my sister. Hey, this happened to me. And it seems like it happens a lot. There needs to be a way for you to be able to check. You know, you can check your credit score. You can check if your bills are paid. There should be a way for you to check to see if you had this so you don't have to get in a car wreck to know. And there is. Anyone can, for $20, go to the Kentucky State Police website and print a form that you can fill out and mail to Frankfurt. Kentucky State Police officials say that it's actually pretty common for people to find they have a bench warrant for a speeding ticket that they thought had been taken care of. And if it shows up when an officer runs your license, he or she has no other choice but to arrest you. If there is a warrant with your name and your birthday on it, you're going to jail. I mean, there's nothing that that police officer can do. Even if he or she believes you, there's nothing that they can do. They have to do their job. Even if you're innocent. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.